What's up, world? Welcome back to another episode of Whiskey and Wrestling. You know two things to make the perfect match. We're your host, HBK Nine Guy, the Cowboy. Get ready, folks, because shit's about to hit the fan. And to be the man, you got to beat the man. Let's get into it. Hey, you know what it is. Summertime, Summer Slam predictions. It is what it is. Let's get it into it. You know, the reigning predictions champ's not here. We got a little space, a little void space. He's starting to be like fucking Roman Reigns, too, bro. He only defends his title at a big pay-per-view. Yeah, he, we get, we, he cutting up just a little bit. Just we, a little we bit. missed, uh, what we missed? We missed Slam anniversary. Yep. Yep. We missed Ring of Honor. We missed uh, the NXT pay per view because he wanted yep. to cut up. He want to cut up. But it's all right. We'll dethrone him this weekend. Hey, we bringing you outside, RB3. We are bringing <laughs> you outside. <laughs> it's time for him to lose the belt, man. We, we, we are the defending. We're fighting champs. We defend all the time. Let's get into this car. Kick it off. Kick it off. All right. I don't know what order this is going to be in, but if I was choosing SummerSlam. This is the order I would put it in. All right. First match of the night. We got Asuka versus Charlotte Flair versus Bianca Belair. Triple threat match for the WWE Women's Championship. That would be the SmackDown Women's Championship. SmackDown Women's Championship. Well, thank, with, you, thank you for clarifying. No problem. With RB3 <laughs> not here, he don't get the side of the order. So we'll go to the side of the order of the day. You want to make him go first? I'll go first. All right, you go first. I'm He'll go second. Lucky. We'll just go. We'll just go down the line. All right, I'll go first. All I'm right, feeling lucky. All right. I, I this is gonna be a dope match. It's gonna be a dope match. I I already know that. Uh, I mean, two of them have good chemistry. Two of them have good chemistry. I don't know about three. Um, Charlotte Flair. I'm going Charlotte Flair. Charlotte Flair to be the new SmackDown Women's Champion. I think she wins it again. I, I don't think... I mean, I, it was in the back of my mind, her retaining, but then I was like, nah. I mean, Bianca becoming a new champion. Then I was torn between Oscar retaining. And that's, I mean, Oscar's Charlotte only had the belt for like a couple months. I'm not an Oscar fan. I'm sorry. RB3 has taken Oscar, And I have taken Charlotte Flair as well. Stop playing. Charlotte. Flair. I can't see all the picks. Can't see all the picks, hey, but great minds think alike. All right. Uh, I was torn. I was torn between those. Nah, two. I wasn't torn. I, I, I was only wanted one person to win this match. But I'm a Charlotte Flair. Flair fan. All right. Next match on the card, we got Gunther versus Drew McIntyre for the Intercontinental Championship. I don't think Gunther loses. You picking Gunther after all these times? I, fucking, I fucking hate Gunther, but I don't think he loses. So you're going Gunther. I'm going Gunther. Well, that's a three-way sweep. RB3 and me have also taken Gunther. All right, next match. We got Ronda Rousey. Sleeper. Versus her ex-partner, Shayna Baszler. Hey, this is a bathroom break match. <laughs> <laughs> I like Ronda. All right, so you taking? That's who I'm taking. Damn, no three-way sweep. We all taking Ronda. I like Ronda. We all, all right. taking Ronda. Next match, we got SummerSlam Battle Royal to be announced. More participants to be announced. So you, you are we choosing a winner of that? Thing, yes. Or are we waiting before? Nah, we're choosing the winner now. It's going to be somebody who's not on the card. Hmm. Me and RB3 have the same person, so we're going to wait and see what HBK's got going on over here. Uh, I, don't, I don't know who is going to be somebody that's not on the card. Hmm. Grayson Wilder's a favorite. I'll let you yeah, know that. Grayson Wilder's a favorite. What if, what if Orton comes back and wins that? Or, you know, what if, what if Orton comes back and wins that? Mm. Uh, is Damian Priest in? Probably. I'm going Damian Priest. Sheamus is probably in it. I'm going Damian Priest. Going Damian Priest. Mm -hmm. All right. Me and Bradley have taken. Oh, L.A. Knight. I changed my L pick. I forgot L.A. Knight. Knight. I forgot L.A. Knight. I changed my pick. I forgot all about L.A. Knight. I'm sorry. <laughs> the most over wrestler right, yeah. in WWE hey, right hey. now. I don't know what I was thinking. I had a brain fart. It even Knight. says L.A. Knight right LA there. Knight. My bad, L.A. Knight. My bad. How do you not see L.A. Knight right there? Where? 
confirmed participants. Right below that. Sheamus and LA Knight. Oh, right there. Yeah. <laughs> my bad. I'm taking LA Knight. I did not know. Yeah, clean my sweep, bad. LA Knight. Hey, this is this is one of those matches they had to get him into to get a win. Yeah, yeah, I'm taking LA Knight. Sorry, Damien Priest. I'm sorry. <laughs> I forgot about LA Knight, my bad. Well yeah. Three more matches? Uh, yeah, three triple more matches. Event. All right, so we got a triple main event. We got Seth freaking Rollins versus Finn Balor. For the World Heavyweight Championship. I'm going Seth freaking Rollins. That's a clean sleep across the board. We are both taking Seth freaking Rollins. It's going to be a banger. Yeah, it's going to be a banger. Uh, Seth is one of my favorites. Next match, we got Cody Rhodes versus Brock Lesnar. Don't forget, there's a match right before. Oh Rhodes. my bad, my bad. Now that's fine. We can do that one, but we, don't forget. Let's do the let's do the Cody and Brock one. All right, that's fine. Who you got? I'm going Cody Rhodes. He Ooh. needs to win some. Cody Rhodes needs to win. Cody something. winning the rubber match. He needs to win something, my guy. Cody winning the rubber match. I he have. Needs to win something. I can't believe I forgot about LA Knight. What the <laughs> fuck have I been smoking? Me and RB3, we also taking Cody Rhodes to win this match. Cody Rhodes to win the match. Hey, I heard Bray Wyatt might show up and start a feud with Cody after this. That'll be dope. That'll be dope. Bray needs to come back. Shout out to Bray. <laughs> Uh, you, all y'all took Cody? Yep. All right, next match. We got Ricochet versus Logan Paul. I got Logan Paul. I don't see him losing to Ricochet. Has he lost yet? Mm -hmm. Roman beat him. Roman beat him. I, I got Logan. I got Logan beat Roman him. beat him. Seth beat him. I got Logan beating Ricochet. RB3 has taken Ricochet. Mmm. I have also taken Logan Paul. <laughs> ah, see? I get you hyped up and I bust your balls. All right. So, next match. Main event, I'm pretty sure all the way around we're picking this. Well, I no, I take it back. I, I think I might be different. So, I think Roman takes a vacation. I'm going Jay Uso. What do you, even, you didn't even discuss the main event. You didn't even say that who was fighting, bud. Roman Reigns. So, Roman Reigns with... Paul Heyman and Solo versus Jey Uso. For the undisputed WWE yeah. Universal Champion and recognition as the Tribal Chief in a tri Tribal Combat Match. I think Roman finally loses. I think that Jey is the new Tribal Chief. And Roman goes down. Even though it's a part of me that doesn't want Roman to lose just yet. Because so many people hate him. RB3 has taken Roman Reigns. And I thought about this one all week long. I gave out different scenarios for the outcome of both guys winning. And only one of them really made logical sense to me. I have taken. Roman. You've taken Roman. Roman Reigns. I know he did. So, if Jay wins, I win. No. If, if Jay wins and Logan wins, I win. I pick Logan. Oh, he picked Logan. God damn it. I don't know. I smoked a lot of weed growing up. That's the only match we got different. Me and you. That's that's it. Right? That's literally what me and you have. It's different. Um, so, if Jay wins, I win, right? Pretty much. Jay, I'm counting Not on Not true, because you and Bradley have a couple different. Jay. You and Bradley have a couple different. But, I'm counting on, on paper, Jay. biggest event of the summer. What are you giving it out of five? This is a stacked card. I ain't no gonna lie. It's pretty stacked, man. You got Cody versus Brock. You got Seth versus Finn Balor. You got Oscar, okay. Charlotte, nah, Finn, Bianca. You got Roman and Jay. Ricochet and Logan Paul. Hey, I bet you. Hey, look, you look, 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 look. This ain't Gunther and hey. Drew. Hey, you, know I, you know I hate bringing up other companies when we do okay. other company right, shit. Right. This ain't gonna be better. I give it four. I give it four. I give it a three and a quarter. Four on paper. I'll give it three and a half. I'll give it three and a half. Four on paper. I'll give it three and a half because my thing is if I like more than half the matches, I give it three and a half. My prediction it would be better than Forbidden Door. No, RB3 is not here to tell us what he thinks is going to be on paper. Any surprises? Randy Orton comes back. Ooh. Also, either Randy Orton comes back or Bray Wyatt comes back as the king. That's my surprise. 
heard rumors that Rock might show up. I heard rumors too. I heard rumors. He gets in the ring, maybe. If it's Roman me and anything, I want to see the Viper come back. That's why I think Roman Reigns is going to win because that is Roman's next feud is with Randy. That's possible. And Randy should be the one to beat him. That's possible. If Randy comes back, he's But if WWE is going to keep it how it is, Roman's going to keep the best of WrestleMania again and fucking Cody's going to rumble beat him and finish the story. That's what's probably going to happen. This, Disappointing as fuck. This will be bigger than Forbidden Door. Mark my words. WWE's on fire. What about 25 jumping jacks on that? <laughs> 25 jumping jacks plus 25 push ups. Hey, I bet you Listen, that, I bet you there won't hey. be a five star match on this like there was on Forbidden I Door. Mean, that's the thing with <laughs> w, that's the thing with WWE though. I watch WWE for the wrestling, but entertainment as well. And I watch hey, AEW hey, for wrestling. Entertainment period. doesn't give you five stars. <laughs> hey, men lie, women lie, numbers don't. Yeah. Whiskey and wrestling, SummerSlam predictions, RB3, he only defends hey, the title. Y'all wait. Four, nigga hey, y'all wait. Next video, I put it on there. You go see one of us with the title. Yeah. He's hey, you that. know what it he's is? We out this bitch. We out this bitch.